Hi there, this is Al from GamingGeek.net and we're going to take a look at the Incredible Hulk Ultimate Destruction, the NTSC version of the uh, PlayStation 2 release. I think this was also released on the GameCube uh, and we're playing it on the Retroid Pocket 4 Pro right now. Uh, I'm using Ether SX2 uh, version 1.4 something, uh, the exact version number will be in the video description. Um, and yeah, this is, um, I'm really going to look forward to playing this game for real myself. Uh, I, I hope I get around to it uh, pretty soon. Just a, I've got a long backlog of games to play. Um, yeah, very underrated superhero game. Uh, and... Well, I like superhero games, so that's why we're going to take a look at how this performs. I tested this before on the Retroid Pocket 3 Plus, and the PAL version actually performed decently, although with some issues sometimes that there are frame rate dips, and we had to use uh, frame skipping, right? Uh, but let's see how this fares on the Retroid Pocket 4 Pro now before uh, we get started, so... Just showing you uh, my, um, well, what time is this? And, and this is my, uh, I'm using high performance and smart fan on the Retroid profile. The Retroid performance profile. And for Ether SX2, uh, what you do is you go into uh, the per game settings and you press on uh, set optimal settings here in general. After that, uh, don't change anything under system. Uh, go into graphics, change GPU render to Vulkan, and I'm thinking about changing upscale multiplier to 1.25x because there's some sort of after image effect that uh, I noticed earlier on. And I'm still thinking about it, but you know what? Let's let's stick with 2x for now. Uh, 2x results in a, a graphical glitch at the edge of the right edge of the screen sometimes um whenever you change the gp render to vulcan you have to enable threaded presentation so make sure that's checked and then for audio um, i use gaussian and then time stretch for sync for interpolation and synchronization respectively uh, if there are any changes i'll mention it in the video description uh, if you don't see me say anything about skipping to the end, then no changes. Uh, but if we do change the settings, I'm going to recap it at the end of the video. So, alright, let's go ahead. And uh, I'm going to just choose easy difficulty, right? Because my concern is really uh, getting as far into the game as possible. It's not really... I'm not aiming to challenge myself in this video, right? Uh, I'll play I'll play this game on normal, at least, when I really do play it. Um, but no, this is just a performance test, right? And uh, let's not make it uh, too challenging. All right. There's a thin line between good and bad. I walk that line every single day. When I stray from it. Yeah, that's Bruce Banner. My name is Bruce Banner. And this is me. I'm not a person anymore. I'm the Hulk. I did this to myself. All in the name of science. This is me. And all that I've become. Yeah, and... I think by now everybody knows who the Hulk is, right? Because of Marvel Studios and the Marvel Cinematic Universe. Um, but I'm, I was never really satisfied with how they handled the character uh, in the Marvel Cinematic Universe films. I mean, he only had one solo movie. And, you know, the character didn't really get explored, right? But here in... Uh, Ultimate destruction. Uh, the the focus is on the Hulk. So, all right. I have to make some changes because um, I like inverted axis. So uh, there and oops, we want some subtitles too, right? Because sometimes I'm talking over the dialogue. Um, so the at least the text is there, right? 
Alright, so a little bit too bright. Let's dim things so that we can. Alright, so. I was thinking about skipping the tutorial, but. It's actually a pretty good sequence, so. So we'll go through the tutorial, right? All right, uh, there you go. Yeah, this is like, uh, I mean, the Hulk is supposed to be a superhero, right? I mean, he's very heroic in the Marvel uh, films, but man, he's straight up murdering here. Like, look at this. Grab, okay. And then punch. That guy's dead, right? Or maybe how about this? All right, throw one human being into another. I did, I tried it there, see, and then try it, try it there. All right, now let's jump. All right, and how about this, right? So a human being. All right, those are fists that, um, you know, go toe to toe with someone like Thanos. These will often launch or stun. As with all other techniques, holding the button will reduce the power of each technique. It is vitally important to research Hulk's various combat abilities. He's not only powerful, but extremely fast. When in close, do not hesitate against him. Fight to win. Alright. All right, now we're gonna get into more tutorials. We'll, we'll have three, right? I'll try to get through them as fast as I can. All right, uh, starting with the closest one. All right, let's look at this fun. Sure. Press and hold the target button to target an enemy. All attacks will be launched. Oh wow, I missed. Target. It moved it moved right when I wanted to hit it. Alright, but not to worry. There are plenty of um you know, projectiles that we can use here. Alright, how about that? Well, of course, accuracy is not that good when the um, target is farther away. But, you know, you, you can charge. Oh, there's nobody else. There you go. Alright, let's see. No, you're ridiculous. Are you? How dare you call Hulk ridiculous, puny human? <laughs> yeah, use the helicopter. It's like Thanos, you know, using the stones to destroy the stones. I use the helicopter to destroy a helicopter. All right, there's uh. Yeah, so when you play this game, you know, go through the tutorial because you're going to unlock some extras here. There, I'm not going to read all that. Uh, oh, yeah, and then there's the next one. It is fun to play, right? Even just these tutorials, it's just uh, really nice. So, w wait a second. Let me just adjust. I'm not happy with how dark uh, it is. 
Who the hell is that? Where are you? All right. All right, now you stop bothering me. Okay. All right, so uh, if you're a subscriber to the channel, you watch my older videos. You might have heard me say this is like Spider Man 2. And this is uh, uh, why I said that, right? Because um, Hulk can climb up walls, climb up buildings. Not in the same fashion, but similar. And uh, check this out. I'm just a simulation, dude. I'm gonna kill you. Or don't make me hungry. Wait. Is that how it goes? You wouldn't like me when I'm hungry? Alright, I'm not getting the... Uh, the trajectory right but yeah just straight up all right there you go wall running and climbing let's go, let's go. Oh, that's not the only lesson um, there you go look at how fast he runs or right? like he does that he does that faster than um, a Spider-Man. Put a missile back in the roof of the building. I'm here, man. What? I'm here. <laughs> I'm not sure. Um, you know what? Because uh, maybe it wants me to... Uh, Crawl up. I mean, climb up like that. Alright, I'm here. I'm not sure why it's not working. It should be working. <laughs> Let me just adjust the, the lighting again. Pick up a missile pack. I'm right here. Oh, crud. Stupid. My fault. Alright. My bad. Pick up. I, I thought it was saying, um, I forgot that you had to pick up. You have to look at that. Hulk has pretty good aim. There, see, oh Canada, or O Canada. I'm not sure if that's O Canada or if that's a code. You know, you can use that. All right, ooh, there. Start mission. So, Hulk's primary method of movement is his ability to leap long distances. Even his smaller jumps are considered impossible by most standards. Follow the instructions on your display to familiarize yourself with this phenomenon. Yeah, so the, like, the jumping mechanic of this game. Did I catch them all? I did. Alright. Not too far. There's the other one over there. Can I catch everything here? Nope. Here, see, it's almost like he's like faster than Spider Man. In Spider Man 2, that is, right? He travels like so fast. Alright. I think we're gonna face some tanks. I, I know there's another, like, uh, mission or something. Alright. This might be another long video, because... Well, you know what happens when, when Once I'm... Hulk has acquired an object, the creature will frequently manipulate it to fashion a makeshift...
makeshift weapon, such as a missile or battering ram. All right, there you go. The ploy, often referred to as the steel fist technique, is to turn a vehicle into a pair of metal balls. Yeah, unfortunate for you. Grab a cow. Except for cows. Oh, but yeah, cows here are like uh, freaking uh, indestructible. So let's. Well, where's the cow? Maybe I'm in the wrong side of the map. Oh yeah, I'm at the I'm at the wrong side of the map. I'm looking for a cow. There, cow. All right, look at this, right? What's he doing? You're slamming, you're slamming the the ground with the cow. The cow's still alive. How about I toss the cow to you? There you go, cow's still alive. Well, there, yeah. Who needs? Weapons when you've got, you know, a cow. Um, but yeah, there's this like a character in the uh, Marvel comics, in the comic books, called Hell Cow. Right? Maybe that's his origin. Right? Got, you know. All right, Steel Fist, so we can end the tutorial. You can't stop me. I'm the Hulk. There, it's a classic move. I think he used that in the um, the Incredible Hulk movie, right? All right. Sorry, it took me so long. I mean, so twenty minutes, right? To almost to get through that, but um, yeah, we'll push forward. I told, I told you guys, this is fun. Um, like smashing things, right? And just traveling around. There, here's a glitch I told you about, right? Bruce, where the hell have you been? Oh, out getting some fresh air. Well, I'm glad one of us was. All right, listen to me. I've intercepted a transmission coming out of Branson Military Base. Some spook named Blonsky's taking charge. They're planning a major foray in your direction as we speak. Requisition half the men and supplies on the base. They know you're out there and they're coming for you. I want you to come back into town and lay low for a while. You're in real danger out there. But if I came into town, everyone would be in danger. Bruce, as your doctor, I'm urging you to reconsider. Your health's deteriorating by the hour. You're not going to find a cure for the Hulk out there by yourself. Hey, you worry too much. Nobody knows I'm here. Yeah, I mean, I'm so engaged, I forgot to talk, right? That, Alright, so here we, we're finally going to get some action. Alright, so... Hulk actually takes some damage here. Um, I mean, this is a video game, right? Um, there, Hulk can... And uh, it, the the system encourages you to like keep fighting, keep smashing, um, because fighting the enemies will get you the health. Uh. Oh man, too late.
there, see? So yeah, it encourages you to beat them up. Now it's uh, suggested that you know you don't rush through the stages because um, where are the tanks? There you go. Um. Where was I? Yeah, because uh, by you know smashing things, you can earn smash points, and uh, you use that for upgrades, right? like learning new skills or whatnot. So you know, don't rush through. But I think uh, there's there's also a balance of. Um, Ooh, good that I just missed a missile. Uh, I can't believe they actually thought they can, you know, take on the Hulk. All right. There are 200 smash points. So you can, like, you know, collect smash points. There's some weird halo effect, see? Banner left his toys in the playground and I'm not there. to watch them burn. I think that only happens because of the upscaling. On the Retro Pocket 4 Pro because the screen isn't as large as the Odin 2. Um one X resolution for me still looks great, right? And uh in between 1x and 2x, uh, they look good. There. Glass effects are also weird when you do upscaling. It was the only chance I had. I didn't have anywhere else to go. Okay, follow me quickly. You should have come here sooner, Bruce. Look, I know, and I'm sorry. The sickness is getting worse. I think the Hulk's trying to break away from me and I don't know how long I'll be able to contain it. It's far from completion, but it's a start. With your expertise added, we can get into your neural generators and figure out what triggers the beast. Now with this kind of processing power, I mean, Len, how are we going to equip it? I already thought of that. Here, put this on. What is it? Think of it as a video game. That was weird. I think I'll, I'll really get this when when I actually play it, right? Um, but this this part I don't understand much. Like, uh, is he wearing some VR sort of thing? Because maybe I should re read up on this. There, so um, escape, blah blah blah. Doctor Leonard Sampson. All right, so it doesn't really tell us uh, what Doc Samson has planned. You're looking at a 3D model of a handheld neural interface. It can perform read or write operations directly into a patient's mind. In effect, the device force feeds mission objectives into your mind, then violently transforms you into the home. I know it won't be pleasant, but it's the only chance we've got.
So they, they did it so that um, they can control what the Hulk does? Is that how it works? There you go. The shade of green that Hulk is in this game is a little different from, you know, how uh, Marvel Studios did it. A little different, like, uh, strong. That, that. Alright, let's go jump. Okay, this is where it's gonna feel like, um, Spider-Man 2. He's dangerous, all right, but he's definitely not um, 5'11 anymore. It's weird. Where's the mission objective? It's here. I'm, it's like I'm right on top of it. Where is it? supposed to do here <laughs> suspect now arm come on no you're gonna see the metrics on the upper right like fluctuate between red white and green Objective complete. I'm not sure what I just completed, but lightning strike. All right, let's go. You're actually shooting against each other. All right, here's now we're going to be traveling to a point. Let's travel. Look at that. Oh, there's a star here. What is this? I think there's a, like a, going to be something that unlocks there later on. We're not here for that. All right. Look at that. See? Now, um... um I'm not going to say that this is a better game than um, Spider-Man 2, right? That's not, because some people can get, you know, argumentative. I'm just saying that start mission. All right. Take a big risk, Bruce. We're going to use the Hulk to help us build the machine through hypnotic implants and auto-suggestion. It's going to take about 5,000 watts to run the equipment. And you want me to smash up the main grid? Just the relevant parts. Hmm. I've identified three key substations that need to be taken out, but be careful. They're surrounded by high voltage Tesla fields. All right, let's accept. There's nothing else to do. Let's destroy these power substations. Um, but yeah, I'm just saying that, uh, you know, in terms of traversing and traveling uh, the city, um,. Hulk does it faster. Um, it essentially gives a, a, a same feeling, same-ish feeling, right? Web swinging and all right. So there, the neuro thingy majiggy. Oh, 
You're too slow. There's the other one. All right. So, opposite direction. He can just run up buildings. He can jump. Ooh. There are pretty good, um, several good superhero games on the PlayStation 2. This is one of them. Right. Oof. That I am. There it is. Nothing can stop me. This is easy mode. So, there's a challenge mission. I don't think I'm gonna take that on. Let's do the story missions, right? Keep it simple. There's plenty of... Um... Oh, wow. The story mission is quite uh, away from here. <clears throat> That's a yeah, pretty pretty long way. Okay. What is that? I saw something here. So coin smash points. I think I already saw the marker, I just ignored it. Um, is it right here? We'll have to be quick. Blonsky knows we're on to him. According to
According to an intercepted memo, his backup data is on a computer terminal inside Division HQ. We need to rip out hmm. the mainframe and bring it back here before Blonsky realizes his mistake. The information it contains could be vital to our chances of success. All right, so another breach division headquarters and escape with the mainframe computer. All right. Now I wonder how many city missions are there there are gonna be. Uh where's my target? Where's my target? Go to, alright. Oh I saw some smash points there. We're we're gonna get that right? Oh, we need this. Yeah, the, the big bad green wolf. Oh wow, found a comic book 5 of uh, 60, look at that, so some collectibles uh, spread across. Hmm. I'm confused, enter the church, yes. Buy menu, all right. Acquired. I wonder which which of these are uh, Airs Express. I have thirty one thousand. Oh wow, it's a lot. Uh, critical atomic slam. Max. I don't think I need that right now. Air recovery, recover instantly. Oh. Yeah, I think we need this. So purchase move. Dashing straight. The high speed attack rate. Running grab. Ground smash. Yeah, I think that's also important. Um... You know what, we'll, we'll leave it at that. Because we might need to, you know, buy, buy the powerful um, move soon. So let's not um, spend all our smash points. Alright, let's just... Uh, Leonard Sampson's hideout. Oh, look at that. What's that? Uh, maybe that's going to be like uh, unlocked later on. Okay. Let's see what we're supposed to find out. Oh, we're going to go to a hotel? Is that still in the city? Is that in the same area? Alright, protect and serve. Oh, 
there. See just how fast um, Hulk just travels. We have a target of opportunity. I've hacked a lab computer at a division research facility, which is illegal. Very. I just tripped a failsafe so Blonsky knows I'm inside. He'll destroy the entire place before he allows the download to complete. You're asking me to run protection while you loot the network. Six or seven minutes, that's all I need. Nice, right? I mean, the aspect of uh, Leonard Sampson and Bruce Banner working together and using the Hulk, right, to uh, complete their mission objectives is very interesting. So now, where's the bio research? What? Man. Where's the enemy? Trying to decoy him. Um, all right. Get out of the way. I don't even know where they are. Oh no! I failed! Can I retry that? I did something uh, in the first mission that uh, helped me last longer. I'm not sure what, what I did, but man, look at that. See, I got stuck. Less than an hour into this, and this is on easy mode. It's a very frustrating, actually. Well, hurry up.
All right, I think I'm gonna. Definitely objects are the way to go. It should be. Man, I'm not even talking. Oh, wow. Uh, whoo! Man, it took me a few, few tries there. Very intense. Gonna have to cut like the what? Uh, what the hell do you mean need to know basis? Calm down, John. You commandeered the inner vault to establish a level 15 clearance. Only the president and senior cabinet members have that access. Surely you of all people don't need a lesson in protocol. No, that, that, that mission was intense. All right, where are we going? Fire sale, all right. I'm not sure if I was able to um, reach this point in my first test. The previous mission was just so intense. I'm not sure if there were any frame rate issues, right? I didn't notice. I was too busy making sure that I completed the mission right? after several attempts. Can accept failure anymore? Oh yeah, and that's uh, that's how strong the 
What was that move uh, when when Banner like when Hulk splits um, when Hulk splits uh, cars? Yeah. We have to start putting the machine together. I'm stuck without a hydraulic lift to move the heavier parts. I need a generator for power conversion and a CAT scan apparatus to get an accurate topographic image of your brain. The locations of these items are marked on the map. So I go from destruction of property to shoplifting. <laughs> wow, I am just racking up the jail time. So don't get caught. Just be aware they've ramped up security at all locations. It gets harder from here on out. Yeah, see how, how different this is? I mean, just the, just the concept, right? Of uh, Hulk doing these missions um, and they're trying to cure him so very different experience from like your spider-man uh spider-man games or your x-men or batman or which is the closest one yeah um, right this looks closer oh Very fun to play. And performance is good, by the way, yeah. So, sometimes I forget. The uh, reason why I'm doing these things is because um, I'm doing a performance test. Okay. Destroy. This is exactly why I... Look at that. I come first comic book six of sixteen. Am I still doing damage? Oh wow, so this is a, like a three-part thing. No, 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 don't fall in the water. <laughs> oh yeah, because he can't. Where's the jump off point? Um, oh yeah, here. I remember you. Okay, I'm not. Uh, I definitely am sure that. Um, I haven't done this mission before. All right, drop item. Go for the other. I have so many smash points. You know what? I'm gonna. No, it's locked. Alright, fine. Um, I have so many smash points. I could. I could afford a lot more moves. Okay. Um, well, we're already facing this way. Ooh. Yeah, good choice. What is that? Oh no. Heal the screen, so what do I do?
Yep. Wonder how we can finish this mission. Man. I don't know. Maybe that's not what we go for first. supposed to do Alright, the jump point, off point is very near. We're almost right on top of it. Poof, alright. Now how the hell do we get rid of that shield? I don't know. That is going to be tricky. We have 60,000 smash points. Maybe easy mode gives you more points, right? I'm surprised we have that many right now. Alright, what does that mean? I don't know how I found that code. Where are my enemies? It's weird. Wow, look at that. We're very close again. Alright, there it is. Didn't make it in one jump, but... Oh, shoot. Come on, Hulk. Stop playing around, Hulk. Alright. Huh, such an intense game. Now what? Okay, so...
Nemesis. You know, let's just take a look at what that that is. Um, but so far, like, yeah, like I mean, they're very intense. Definitely buying Atomic Slam now. And Air Stomp. What's this backhand? It's just like a combo. Okay. Steel Fist. That's what the... Let's do this. Dashing straight. Alright. Should have bought that earlier. Alright. So. Bought some moves. Says Nemesis. I'm not sure what that means. Is that a boss fight? Is there a refacing Blonsky? The human form of Blonsky? Let's see. Wait. What's this? There's something happening at the military base. Listen to this transmission. That's not you, Bruce. Better go check it out before someone decides this is your fault. All right, look at that. I don't remember this. I'm pretty sure we didn't experience this in my first test when I tried this for the Red Red Pocket 3 Plus. Ooh, Abomination. Some hell. <laughs> Damn you. It'll soon be over. I'm mindless, sir. The one who tries to sell it with your fist. Oh, he's fast. I'm not sure I can beat him. Oh. <laughs> 
All right. So intense, man. Well, thank goodness there are. I ran out of objects. Can you grab this? Down the wire. Oh man, look at that. What just happened? Mission complete? Oh, wow. All right. So we'll just to take a look at our battery meter here. 71%. I think we started at around, um, I forgot, 90? 100, but yeah. So hey, I'm going to wrap it up here. That was a pretty intense sequence um, to end the episode in. And yeah, Blonsky, I think we'll be seeing more of him. Uh, if you play the game, by the way, but yeah, the Incredible Hulk Ultimate Destruction. Oh man, feels uh, nice to play on the Retroid Pocket 4 Pro. No underclocking. It, the metrics go red often, but I never felt like um, performance actually dipped. So um, I had fun. I can't wait to play this on my own. Badlands. Wait, no. I said Badlands. Um. Yes, yeah, let's go to. So here, not 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 the city. Last Chance Cafe. Okay, but yeah, try it out. Yeah, uh, this is an underrated. Um superhero game again very different uh not just fighting bad guys but oh there's another cow uh you're trying to cure banner right uh and uh, take on these missions so uh plays well again on the retro pocket 4 pro it's just really really intense so hope you guys enjoyed this episode check this game out once again this is al from gaminggeek.net Oh, did, did the cow turn transparent? Look at that. Cow turned transparent. You can see the... the see. It's transparent. You can see the pole right through the cow. Look at that. The cow's still alive. Once again. <laughs> there you go. Yeah. Ultimate weapon. The cow. See, everyone... Um, but the cow's still alive. Right. Radioactive cow. Um, once again, this is Al from GamingGeek.net. Talk to you in the next video. Oh, what's that? Shiny? No.